Hey guys, I'm Teffel and welcome in my Unreal Engine 4 tutorial channel. I prepared something special for you today. So recently I was working on the update of a long time forgotten inventory plugin, which I submitted somewhere in March 2018. So it's already three years ago. And I'm really excited to tell you more about upcoming changes. You are probably wondering why I even bothered to update my plugin right now. Um, and you're right, <laughs> and I wouldn't do this if I don't think uh, this update, which I call 2.0, brings something exciting to the, to the plugin. So what actually it brings, it gives you full integration of online uh, services. So your players will be able to not only register and log in with different like Facebook, Twitter, different ways and resetting the password when needed, but also from Lobby, they will be able to change all the account details, inviting friends, uh, going to the game, but also it provides uh, online transactions. So you will be able to create a store which offers items and you can purchase them directly with the normal currency, like euro, dollars, but also with a currency, a virtual one. And this way, I'm able to integrate everything into, into, into the plugin and provide two different examples. So the first one is the basic one, which is just the server client communication when players are uh, getting into the chest, putting some items so other players can see live updates. So server is always authorizing everything like um, every move of, of the player, if they can pick the item. But with advanced plugin, you have this uh, vendors where you go directly and you can open the online shop inside the game and you can purchase every item and uh, suddenly you can pay with your credit card or with your virtual currency. And this item is automatically moved to your inventory and you can equip it. So I'm super excited about this. That's why I'm going to make uh, like series of videos about integration into your game, about the Exola integration of these uh, transactions. So I will explain everything uh, one by one. And if you already purchased this plugin, obviously you are getting an update for free. So hopefully you, you liked already this video and uh, in the remaining uh, part of this video, I will just uh, show you a little bit of sneak peek of this upcoming uh, update. When you open the inventory system uh, for the first time, you will see this new simple uh, menu where you can pick between basic example and this advanced example with Exola, which provides uh, online services integration and transactions. So this is what we are going to pick uh, now. And as you can see, uh, system asked me for some credentials so I can use my username and password. I can obviously use also Facebook, Google, Twitter, and many, many others to, to log it to the, to the game. Uh, as you can see, there are plenty of them, but I can also use my demo user. And this is what we are going to do now. And after selecting demo user, I'm just automatically logged into the, to the game. So in this menu, I can uh, access my friends. This is pretty standard. I can check my pending request, I can find them with the nickname, add friends. Then I have my character where I can check my level and I can upgrade a level of the character using virtual currency. Then I have my user account with all details like phone number, first name, last name, etc. Then I have my inventory and store. So inventory shows me all my items which I purchased and they are linked to my account. And I can also, obviously, from the main menu, I can purchase new item. So I can put some items to the store and I can pay, purchase them either with the virtual currency or with a normal currency with a credit card. So let's start the example right now. So when I press start the game, it will start the map, which is, uh, which is demo example. And as you can see, uh, this plugin got visual overhaul and I think now fits uh, way better this medieval theme. So uh, currently I'm yeah, walking on the scene. Uh, so it's basically what it was before. Uh, 
So I can open my inventory with uh, I and uh, you will see that uh, I have already equipped my uh, helmet but I can take the, uh, this off and I can obviously take it back to my player inventory. So I can do this uh, back and forth. I also have some items which I can equip and they are immediately appearing in the in the player hand. So everything is like server client uh, working. I can obviously open the chest, I can drag items, I can swap items either in the chest, then I can drop something to the container. When I move automatically a uh, container or chest is uh, closing for me so server cares about even details like this so no players have a chest open when they are like far away from the chest and uh, i can also transfer whole gold from uh, from this world storage and gold was transferred and i can also transfer all the items so this is basically everything about the the storage and the same way this barrel works, so I can also take this item from the barrel. And this is uh, how this example was constructed. A new thing what, what is coming from, from the plugin is that I can pick now gold, and it gives me gold uh, to my inventory. And with this gold, I can find in the world some shop, like this local plate vendor. And what it does, what he, what he does, he's selling me items, which I can just simply drag and drop. And now you see that uh, gold is decreasing. So whenever I purchase something, I just pay the price for, for this item. And this is uh, basically working this way. So this is everything for the uh, client and server uh, that every player who is... Uh, accessing the chest can, can put some items and uh, some other players may put something on the ground and uh, another player can pick it up and everything is uh, being synchronized like client server and obviously uh, also equipment is working uh, nicely so when i pick and equip um, my bracelets i can also swap them on the fly everything is updated so all, all the players will see uh, everything being updated in the game but what is uh, coming with Exola is uh, this uh, transaction system where I can find online vendors, which are, I call them global one. So there is a global gold armor vendor, maybe I should change the name. But anyway, so when I press him, he offers me some items which I can buy with a uh, normal currency. So when I purchase something, it opens uh, for me uh, immediately after uh, my credit card and I can just use my credit card uh, number and I can purchase this item to my global inventory and then I can uh, I can when the transaction is over I can go to my global inventory the second tab and I can either consume something if it was consumable or I can just uh, I can just wear this so as you can see I have glove, gloves uh, gold gloves uh, now uh, were on my character so i can also take them out and no matter where you put them you can put them on the ground they will be just unequipped so this is basically how this global inventory works so now maybe let's try to consume something and i'm consuming now mushroom and yeah successful you have consumed mushroom and it went through http request from the server i get response so i consumed a uh, mushroom and the server can uh, give me some extra bonuses because I've done this. Maybe increasing speed of the of the character or whatever we want, actually. So yeah, now I don't know if you notice, but number of uh, mushrooms decreased by one uh, after I consumed. Maybe let's try consuming now nuts. So let's do the same. And yeah, as you can see, everything is fine and is disappearing. So what I have in my inventory, one last thing, is that I have virtual currency, it's 70. So I can find the vendor, which is a global vendor, which offers me something where I can buy for virtual currency. So here I don't have uh, anything what I can buy. Uh, these are capes, okay. And uh, let's find uh, maybe another vendors. 
So I can pick up everything from here. I can go look around. I think it looks uh, not so bad. <laughs> so there is a shield I can pick up. I can wear the shield. Uh, yeah, so I can uh, wear also the, the necklace. So my character looks now way, way, way better. So uh, what is this global consume vendor? Uh, okay, so it allows me to buy some consumables from the from the online store and as you can see here i can buy uh, nuts with the virtual currency so let's do this now so uh, i just need to confirm do i want to spend my virtual currency uh, to buy this item yes and when it's successful you see my number of uh, silver coins decreased and i got this item in inside my inventory and i can obviously spend also my uh, money. So let's buy uh, one more, more mushroom and you can use testing uh, credit card number which is also provided by Exola. So this is also what I'm going to do now. So it's uh, super simple like uh, 4111, 12, 40 and 123. <laughs> and yes, I can just purchase this and after doing this transaction and uh, uh, providing all the necessary data, I can just confirm it and you will see that a uh, transaction went uh, is successful and uh, thank you for your pur purchase and I can go back to my game and as you can see there is a successful and I have my mushroom added to to the game so yeah uh, there are also uh, coins which I can pick it up but this is just a tiny tiny thing and uh, yeah, everything is, like I said, uh, multiplayer. So if you have many players, they can also join the session and they can also do everything uh, what you would normally expect from games like Diablo or something like this. So yeah, uh, this is going to be everything for this uh, short update. And I will prepare uh, some uh, detailed uh, videos about integration of this plugin. So please uh, stay tuned and Obviously, if you like this um, uh, and you like uh, everything regarding Unreal Engine 4, uh, please don't forget to subscribe this channel and like always, uh, see you next time.